Welcome. So what I have here is log base 2 thirds uh, is equal to 9 over 4. And who? man, this just doesn't look like fun. Um, so a couple things. If I have, so again, we're raising things to a power. Um, so let's just go back and review what happens when I raise a fraction to a power. Remember, that's a to the m over b to the m. But let's also talk about what about if I raise it to a negative power? Well, therefore, I can take the reciprocal of that and raise it to the positive power. So therefore, it would be b to the m over a to the m. All right, that's going to become very important because when I start looking at this as 2 thirds, I'm going to start raising it to a power. Now, obviously, 2 thirds raised to the 0 power is just going to give me 1. 2 thirds raised to the first power is just going to give me 2. So let's, let's start at um, 2 thirds squared and 2 thirds cubed. See if that's going to get us anywhere. So therefore, that's 2 squared over 3 squared, which equals 4 ninths. Very close, um, but not exactly. And then let's do the cube. That will give me 8 over 27. All right, now my numbers, they're getting a little too far away, right? Oh, I'm sorry, that's going to be 2 cubed over 3 cubed, which equals 8 over 27. All right, but now how about we take a look at our negative numbers? So if I did 2 thirds to the negative power, what that means now is I can take the reciprocal of that and raise it to that power. All right, so if I have the negative, raise it to the negative second power, I can take it to the reciprocal and this raise it to the positive power, which would be 3 squared over 2 squared, which is equal to 9 over 4. So therefore, we look at this and we say, so 2 thirds raised to what power is going to give us 9 fourths? Oh, I'm sorry. That's not equal. It's going to give us 9 fourths. That answer is negative 2. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you evaluate a logarithmic expression. Thanks.